Manuel from Chain Graphics. Today I'm going to explain the tools needed for the car wrap. Let's go ahead and do it. Okay guys, today I'm going to explain the tools needed for the car wraps. And the first tool you will need is a squeegee. You can buy three different types of squeegee. The first one is like this. It's just regular squeegee. This one you can use it for small vehicles or any wrap. But the one I recommend for wrap is the one that has a felt thing, like a soft part. But this one, there are two different ones. This one it will work too, like this one. But this one it will last, it will last longer because this one has like a leather thing so this one will last longer but if you, you only need it for one time maybe you can go for this one you can get it on ebay this one you can get it on ebay too but this is made of leather and this one is just like a cheap thing <laughs> but you can use this one too this one will work too this one will last longer this one will work too this one you will need it to put the vinyl straight to remove the bubbles. So first thing, squeegee. Okay, the next one is the knife. The knife you, you will need it to cut the vinyl on edges or to trim the parts. This one is an alpha knife. This one will last longer, but it's a little more expensive. And this one, will do the same work but this one is cheaper and in this is made of plastic and this might break and this is made of metal so both will go i'm gonna put put the links so you can choose which one this one will last longer this one maybe less but if you need, need only need it one time So be careful with this one you might burn the vinyl or even the paint <laughs> so you have to be very careful with this one and this one i love this one but sometimes i go outside to do installations and they don't have power connection when i don't have power connection i use this one next tool the magnets i use the magnets to hold the vinyl on the car I just place the magnets and 
it will hold the vinyl in the position that you want and then you can peel the backing. But I have two different ones. I have this one and I have this one. Both are good. This one is more stronger. <laughs> this one is more stronger and this one is good. But if it's too, if it's too windy, if you're doing it outside, <laughs> The, the air will blow this one very easy so I always use this one but the only problem about this one when it's in, in holding the vinyl in the car it's harder to lift it and this one has like a handle to lift it. but remember some cars now the new ones are some of them are made of uh, aluminum and this will not work on an aluminum or fiberglass, only on metal, okay guys? So, this only for metal, but these ones are a lot of help. If you are doing a wrap, you will need this, okay? Okay, and now the application glove. This is the application glove, it's just like a regular glove. But this one, what is difference about the other gloves, this one, will not uh if even if you touch the vinyl it will not mess up the glue that's why they made these gloves and also you can use the hand to remove the bubbles on the on the wrap with this there are different brands of gloves the buy the cheapest one all of them will do the same the same work as the, the, more, the most expensive or the cheapest one, all of them are the same. So just get our application wrap glove like this. You can find it on eBay or on Amazon. I'm gonna post the links on, for all the tools on the description. Okay, the next tool is called a Sneedy. A Sneedy is like a blade, it has a blade inside. You can use it to cut the vinyl. The good thing about this, if you try to, to cut the vinyl <laughs> with the blade, you might risk, might risk a scratch, to do a scratch on the paint. You don't want to do that. So this one will save you from scratching the car paint. This one is super fast and easy. Just boom, put it inside. It has like a... Here you can put the vinyl inside and slide it and cuts the vinyl super easy. You will need this. This one are like uh, two or three dollars. Super cheap and super good. Another thing, I have a spray bottle with alcohol. <laughs> alcohol is super good and cool. And uh, this one will remove the, the wax and e e every bad thing on like a grease or oil on top of the on the paint this the the alcohol will remove it super fast even glue the but the glue is, it will take more time you have to clean it a couple of times this one but it's before you do a wrap you always have to clean the paint or the parts with the alcohol okay the next tool is this one this is called Flex Stream by Avery but also you can use a squeegee like this this one sometimes on the windows they have a small plastic with this one you can lift the plastic and with a squeegee you can tuck the vinyl inside so it will, the work, it will look more nice and more professional but both of these will do the same work you can buy this one, you can buy this one. Then, okay, the next one is called Power Trim Tool. This one is to remove obviously, obviously the trims or plastic that are on the edges or hard to remove. With this one, it's better because you will not scratch the paint of the car. This is super cool. You can buy the, a set for a cheaper price. I don't remember how much is the set. I'm gonna put the link, but this one it will help you a lot if you try to to use a screwdriver you will scratch the paint and it's gonna mess it up 
Okay, so you only need one, but if you want the set, buy the set, but you never know when are you gonna use the small ones or the big ones. So this one is good. And the last one is tag reducer. If you are using 3M vinyl, or are you using, if you are using Avery vinyl, you will not need tag reducer. This is only for the economic brands like uh, Chinese brands or other brands, like people say cheap brands. <laughs> because the cheap brands they don't have the control tag so as soon as you stick the vinyl to the paint it's hard to peel it off or to lift it to put it in the position that you want so with this it's like you are using the tag reducer this will well the tag it will be less less tacky so you can lift it easier so this one will help you a lot. <laughs> it helped me a lot on the on the vinyl. The first parts I started without this, it was so hard. <laughs> but after I use this, less hard. This one will help you a lot. Okay. Also, there are some special wrap car wrap cleaners out there. I'm gonna post the link. Avery has their like a, or their own brand, and there are all another brand. I'm gonna put it. I'm gonna put the link. Those are special sometimes they make one one cleaner for matte finishes and another cleaner for gloss finishes those will will make your car wrap last longer okay okay guys those are all the tools that i have if you know a tool that is good for car wrapping put it on the comments and uh, if you have uh, some ideas on car wrapping put it in the comments and also you have a question Ask a question, I will try to answer my best. So if you like the video, please like the video. And if you are new, subscribe. See you in the next video.